Hello and welcome to HD Calcs. I'm Rick and in this video we're going to have a look at how we can use the random function on the Texas Instruments TI-30X2S calculator. To do this we'll be using the second function key that looks like this located here. The PRB or probability key that looks like this located here and the right bracket key with the second function of a comma that looks like this, located here. To get to the random function menu, we press the PRB key, which will bring us to this menu. And now if we scroll to the right three times, or the left once, we see this menu here, RAND and RAND I. If we select RAND, our calculator will give us a value between zero and one. So if we press enter on that, we see we get RAND on our screen, and if we press enter, we see we get a decimal between 0 and 1. If we keep pressing enter, it'll keep giving us a new random decimal. Our other option is RAND I, or random integer, which lets us tell our calculator two values, and it'll give us a number in between them. Again, we get to that by pressing the probability key, scrolling over, selecting RAND I, pressing enter. And we see this on our screen, RAND I, and an open bracket. We can use this to, for example, simulate a dice roll, if we want to get a value between 1 and 6. We tell our calculator the two values we want, so 1, and then we have to press a comma in between them, so we press second close bracket, and that gives us a comma, and then 6, and we'll close that. And now if we press enter, we see we get a random number between 1 and 6. Something we can use if we forget our dice on board game night. Alright, I hope this helps, and good luck on those tests out there everybody!